is your role in a real estate transaction as a lawyer? Um, so if I'm representing a buyer, I will handle uh, reviewing offer if that's needed. I will review the purchase and sale agreement. We'll handle any title issues that come up. We make sure we review the title exam and make and to make sure the title is clear before everyone buys. Um, and we just work through any other issues that might be available. We also. Hello, everyone. Welcome to Living in Central Massachusetts, where we discuss everything real estate, our clients, our community, and our agents. Today, we have Sharon LaPointe with us. Sharon LaPointe is with Cossies and LaPointe Law Offices, and they're located in Worcester, Massachusetts on uh, Highland Street. And I am Juliana with Century 21 Excel Realty. Um, welcome, let's go to Sharon. Welcome Sharon to the well, Hi. chat. Mm -hmm. How are you? I'm well, how are you? Okay, yes. all right. So we have known each other for quite a while, several years. Yes. yes. And you've been there for us helping our clients and um, make their dreams come true. Uh, yes. Can you give us a little background how long you've been uh, helping clients in uh, their transactions? Mm -hmm. Well, I've been, I've been practicing exclusively real estate for about 11 years. Okay. Um, prior to that though, I've been a lawyer for 30, over 30 years. Um, wow. I did, I, I, yeah, I worked a little more with corporate and some real estate, but I've been with Harry's office and practicing solely real estate since 2009. Oh, nice. Yeah. yeah, it's been a while. It's been fun been though. Fun. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And what is your role in a real estate transaction as a lawyer? Um, so if I'm representing a buyer, I will handle uh, reviewing offer if that's needed. I will review the purchase and sale agreement. We'll handle any title issues that come up. We make sure we review the title exam and make and to make sure the title is clear before everyone buys. Um, and we just work through any other issues that might be available. We also handle bank transactions so we could handle the, the mortgage work for the client and for that client's lender. Um, if we're on the selling side, it's similar. We will prepare the purchase and sale agreement and uh, negotiate those terms, handle any title matters as well. Uh, and then we will take care of the closing for that client. Very, very nice. So why is it important that all parties in the real estate transactions get representation? Um, I think it, it helps to, it, it, first of all, it's, it's good to have a lawyer to protect their individual interests, uh, especially on a buyer's side when they're putting down large amounts of money as deposits. You wanna make sure that everything goes smoothly. Um, plus it helps to, if there are issues that come up to be able to amicably uh, resolve those issues and work through them. So it is good to have representation on both sides. Awesome. Because we run into sometimes uh, buyers and sellers that don't want any lawyer right. representation. It makes our life difficult. We makes it a little more challenging. Yes, it does. Yeah. <laughs> so what do you love about your job, what you do? Yeah. Um, I love that every transaction is a little bit different. So and there's not, you know, they're new and you're always learning something. I like the little challenges that come along. Plus, I also love meeting new people and helping them realize their dreams, as you had mentioned earlier, uh, mm -hmm. with especially first time home buyers buying their first home. It's, it's very exciting. Yes. Yes. Yeah. To be part of that when they get their key, right? Oh, yes. And that big smile. Yeah, it's very exciting. <laughs> Yeah. Do you live in Central Mass and, and where? What town? I live in Worcester, actually. Oh. Yeah. And I've lived, I've been in Worcester um, pretty much since I've moved to uh, Massachusetts in 1990. Oh. That's, yeah. That's a lot. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, and what uh, is your favorite places in, in Worcester? Or, in, so in Worcester or around Worcester? In Worcester County, I, I love the outdoors. So I would say, you know, I love Wachusett Mountain and, and the, the hikes and the skiing and 
things you can do there. Um, I also like the museums here. Worcester Art Museum is wonderful uh, to, to go there. There's the Botanical Gardens, which, um, which is in Boylston, and I, I, I enjoy that um, area as well. Uh, not to mention, you know, Cape Cod. I always say you're like one hour from the mountains, one hour from the beaches. Uh -huh. <laughs> anything here so it's a great location <laughs> yeah so you do uh, spend some time in in the cape on in, in the summer times right yeah I, I don't i don't yeah so we'll go down um for a day or so um there are other great beaches besides the cape there's beaches in westport um mm -hmm. and other areas that are still in massachusetts that are just as as pretty so awesome. all right so what is like your favorite restaurant or place that you go with a family here around here. Mm -hmm. So my one of my favorite restaurants is Fatima's and, um, and it's a, um, a family owned business right on West Boylston Street. It's a little cafe. Okay. Um, the owner is fantastic. The food is so good. It's very fresh and authentic. It's, it's African cuisine and it's just delicious. It's like one I go there almost every week. So oh, that's that's nice. Nice. so yeah. what, what is the, your favorite dish there that you well, I always get the veg, the vegetable wrap and the uh, samosas, which is the appetizer, um, not the very spicy ones because I don't do that, but the others. And that's what I get every single time. I, I don't eat meat or anything, so those are perfect. And uh, actually, I went there for my birthday and he gave me a little cake and everything. They're just they're wonderful people. Yeah, Oh, that's nice. The other place I really like Purgatory Chasm in oh, Charleston. Yeah, not too far from yep. Boston. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's that's a fun place to go. I like uh, the Quabbin Reservoir is another good one. And then in Clinton, you have the Museum of Russian Icons. Oh, I didn't know about that. Wow. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. so that's another great place to uh, check out, too. Yeah, I, and I like Clinton. In the summertime, some some of our friends will go there and walk on the dam. You walk yes, there. Up, yeah, yeah, that was... Yeah, watch it Reservoir. Yeah, yeah it's great bike bike riding around there too is, is right. um cycling is great yeah right. lots to do awesome awesome so here at century 21 we appreciate all the hard work that you and your office does for us and uh, we've been doing a lot of business together and we will continue doing that and we thank, thank you thank very you. much for taking time out of your busy schedule to the chat with us so oh well thank you for having me we enjoy working with your office as well and uh we look forward to more mm -hmm. more work together. Yes, yes. yes. Thank you very well, thank much. Thank you for having thank me. You're welcome. And we'll share your information on our link. So if anybody needs to reach you, they will be able to reach you. Okay. Thank Perfect. you very much. We appreciate yeah. it. Yeah. Okay. Have an awesome day. You Thanks. too. Enjoy the yeah. rest of your day. You and too. thank you all for coming to um, Living in Central Mass. And look out for another chat next week. Thank you. Awesome. Thank right. you. Bye. -bye. Bye.